Well, hello everyone. Welcome back. My name is Atia. Today I will be doing a review on the Sigma brushes. So stay tuned. First, I would like to thank Sigma for such a beautiful package. Look how cute it's black. It has this beautiful pink ribbon. As well, I want to thank Daisy for enlightening me on these Sigma brushes. So, you guys, let's get all into this box and I'm going to show you guys how we're going to wash them. Stay tuned. Before we get the cleaning, I guess I can show you the brushes. I have this right here to keep all my brushes in. It's most likely every brush that you can get from Mac, it's right up in here. And I like this because it smells so leathery. And you snap it, and you're good to go. You're not going to miss it. It's going nowhere. So I love this. So um, I have that. I'm definitely going to be doing a look on the uh, smoky eyes. Definitely will be having a look on the neutralize. These are so cute. They're so fun and colorful. I like these that they have the little um, thing you can take the palettes out. Right here, you can switch them out any way you like. It's just real nice. If I can get it out. Oops, has a mirror right there. And you can put your little things right here. Really cute. So definitely stay tuned for a Sigma eye tutorial. And as well, I have two more brushes. And all oh, the famous, uh, and like for instance, if you're used to MAC, it has the S182, like my buffer brush from MAC. Hold on, I'm gonna show you. Right here, and this is theirs. And same, same nice, soft, so, yeah. So, let's see. Last but not least, my favorite. Look how pretty and pink is hot. And it comes in a pretty uh, pink and gold rim. It has Sigma makeup. And drum roll. And it has this pretty dazzle thing. Oh, my goodness. I mean, stuff has it going on. It's beautiful. Beautiful packaged. Uh, you won't be sorry the way everything is well put together. And look how pretty. Oh my gosh, this is some hot stuff. And you put yourself here. Oh, it's really pretty. And you have a little bag to keep it in. Again, lock it tight. It's not going anywhere. And huh, I would definitely say this is probably is one of my favorite things right here. Again, not going anywhere. You know why? Because, hello. Hello. So cute. Oh, this is so cute. This definitely is going to be with me 24-7. So as well, it has a pretty pink bag. You keep up with this. I definitely need one because my other one is out of there. It has had it. So I'm going to show you guys how to wash your brushes. So y'all ready? Let's go. Okay, you guys, so the reason why I want to show you guys how to wash these uh, Sigma brushes is because when I got them, I said that like, they really had like a little light smell to them. Uh, nothing really, really bad, but just like a, a slight little smell. Nothing really, really that you can be alarmed by. But anyway, I want to show you guys different ways you definitely can wash these brushes before using them. From my understanding, everybody say you must do that anyway, regardless of what brush it is. So, uh, but like, it was more of the... This little light smell just, I was like, wait a minute, I think I need to wash this first. So, what I'm going to do uh, is show you how to wash the brush. So, first, we're going to add uh, either some Johnson's & Johnson's Baby Shampoo or the famous Purity Made Simple. As well, I'm going to be using this as a one-step facial cleanser. I'm going to wash my face with it as well. Um, look it up on philosophy.com or as well, you can look it up on Sephora. So, what I'm going to do is add, uh, let's see, let's add... Let's see. And I have the pump. And I ordered it from... So I'm going to do one pump. I had to order this one if you want the pump. And it was like 45 And I'm just going to take some lukewarm water. Yeah, that's good. And we're going to fill the bowl up. Okay. 
Okay, so I filled both bowls up, one with Johnson & Johnson, which that is a cheaper route, and the Purity Made Simple is a little steep, but as well, if you want to use that for your face, for other things, definitely that would be a good uh, thing to try if you have it, if you have the money to do that. Um, so I'm going to take the brush and I'm going to dip it. Just going to dip it just like you wash them. Just dip it like a mop like that. Just to get that little light smell off of it. You can just let it sit for a second if you want to and just swish it around back and forth. And so I'm going to sit this down and I'm going to drain the water out. Okay. So I have a towel and I'm just going to do this to it. Just take a towel and I'm going to brush it back and forth. On each, if you want to, just please put like one drop. I think that purity to make simple powder was too much because I'm here in suds. So, yeah. So, what I'm going to do is take some water and make sure all the suds are out. Yeah, much better. Okay? Much better. So once again, just take your towel. So once you take a towel, you're going to see that it's getting back to how it was when you brought it out of your bag, out of your uh, case. And then overnight, just have it flat out like this on a towel to dry. And in the morning, you can start using them. So just repeat all those and I'll be right back. Okay, so now all the brushes are washed and not ready to be used. Uh, again, I used the Johnson Johnson's Body Wash or the Purity Made Simple. You can use whatever you like. It's totally up to you. As well, I would like to thank Sigma for some great brushes. Again, I always uh, get asked what are some good alternative brushes, and I think these are great alternatives because a lot of times I do use MAC, and I could be like, okay, take off the 138 or the 128, the 129. It's right here in the Sigma pack, so you'll be right on board. It's not going to be hard because here it has the SS182 or the SS117, so it's right in this bag. Again, thank you, Desi, for enlightening me on these brushes because I was so behind. So I have some great alternative brushes, and I feel so good about that. As well, Sigma will be giving away three brush prizes. Yes, so you must be on my YouTube channel, my Twitter channel, and my Facebook. So uh, this week, I'm going to ask you a question. The first person that answers gets a free brush set. So thank you once again, Sigma. You guys stay tuned for all the questions. I love you guys, and you may just be a winner. Bye.